So the tires were shot on my electric lawn tractor project. In the last video, I bought some brand new ones from Royal King for about $100 for all of them. And in this video, let's put them on and take it for a spin. Well, I'd have to say I'm pretty happy with that how, how that turned out. These wheels make it stand up like an inch taller, which is pretty awesome. Now, I did notice that the wheels were different sizes, barely, but it doesn't, doesn't seem to have much of an effect. I'm glad about that. Also, I broke the pins because they were old, and so I just put some welding rods through there, and those work pretty nice. I can always get actual cotter pins or whatever they're called, though. Now that we have all this together, let's start adding the batteries. We'll go 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, and 72 volts and see how that does.
I do have to say, that definitely does tear up the yard. You can see over here. Especially over here. I was turning pretty hard. Given though, it, it, the, the ground is pretty muddy and it's not even spring yet, so nothing's really grown much. Now, the next thing I'm going to have to do is build something to hold the batteries in place so they don't keep shifting around whenever I accelerate or decelerate. I'll probably do that out of wood. Also, since, since that test, I just added this on here, hoping that it would help steering, but it doesn't really help steering much. I believe the issue is with these bearings right here. I'm going to get a grease gun and fill those with grease because they're really lacking any lubrication at all. I say let's take it for a spin now. I like this. It's really awesome. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video and thanks for watching. See ya!